This question belongs to salient pull synchronous machine to calculate E phase and delta of salient pull synchronous machines we need a phasor diagram. First we develop that then once you know the phasor diagram from that you can calculate any question easily by substituting the values that is E phase vector and this is V this is E the angle between them is delta in the generator E leads V so let us say this is a A so parallel to this there will be a A R A next there will be a A is resolved into two components one is a Q quadrature axis component and id angle between e and i a psi angle between v and d delta so obviously this is 90 this is psi and this will be 90 minus psi let this be a triangle o x y this is z next this is id r a this is i q r a from this i d x d IQ, XQ. This was the basic phase diagram we can develop for serial pole synchronous machine. We can extend this. We can extend this to get a simple equations to calculate the questions like According to geometry, we are extending like this. So, this is 90, this is 90, this V phase, and what is the angle between V and IA means phi. So, this is V phase sin phi, and this is V phase cos phi. So, remember this line is a parallel one like this. So, let us take this is O, this is A, this is B, C, D, E, F. Now, we can develop. E phase is equal to this V, this is delta, V cos delta plus the small one IQ RA. plus ID XT. Again, according to geometry, this is psi as this is 90, this is also psi, psi is, this one is pi plus delta, pi is power factor angle, delta is torque angle or load angle or power angle. <coughs> From this, there are three triangles we have to take care now. First, triangle 1. From 
O X Y cos 90 minus psi is equal to I D I A I D by I A therefore I D is equal to I A sin psi next from triangle O Y Z cos psi cos psi is equal to I Q by I A therefore I Q is equal to I A cos psi. These conclusions are available for solving the final things. Next, from triangle B C D cos psi is equal to B C by B D. What is cos psi from this? I Q by I A. What is B C? I Q X Q by B D. From this what we can say is B D is equal to I A X Q. From this the conclusion is B D is equal to I A x q remember this conclusion useful for the later solvings now from triangle o a b we can write tan psi tan psi is equal to a b by o a what is a b means a d plus d b by OF plus FA then tan psi is equal to what is AD? AD is V phase sin phi plus what is BD? IAXQ by what is OF V phase? cos phi plus what is F A? I A R A. These are parallels. I A R A. This is one equation. In this equation, we know everything. It was given in the question that X D X Q supplying rated voltage at point at power factor lagging. So, you can take everything per unit it was asked. So, V per unit, 1 per unit, everything you can take and phi is also given 0.8 per factor lagging angle is 36.86 degrees lagging so what are known here ra is negligible because nothing is given in the question ra is negligible this we can neglect negligible we know cos phi 0.8 we know v phase 1 per unit 1 per unit we know sin phi we know ia again it was given xq in the question as 0 0.6 per unit you can use this so, by substituting all, we can calculate psi from this equation. Once you know psi, use here. You know psi and already you know power factor angle that is 36.86 degrees. Once you know power factor angle and psi, what we can find out? We can find out delta. Once you know delta, again you can find out V cos delta. IQ, how to calculate IQ? IQ is equal to IA cos phi. IA is 1 per unit, cos, phi, cos psi is known from this. Again, ID, XD. Anyway, RA is 0. The term can be negligible. So, then if you calculate E phase, you are going to get E phase at an angle delta. So, we get E as well as delta by substituting all the given things. Any question, you can calculate from this phase diagram regarding saline pole machine.